is Sarah McKenna. Weather from where you live. Good morning. Well, we're starting off pretty pleasant this morning. 72 degrees right now in Lafayette. The humidity, not too bad. But you will notice over into St. Louis, 82 degrees. All that heat going to be moving this way, and we are expecting to see warmer temperatures filter in with that as well. Now, for today, we're starting off with a little bit of cloud cover, and I do expect us to see cloud cover throughout the day today. I do think we'll end up seeing some peaks of sunshine. You'll also notice rain showers, though, most of which will be staying to the north of us. A small chance of rain in our forecast for today. You'll see more about that though in future casts. First though, we have to worry about the heat for today. Your high expected to get up to 92 degrees. A very hot day. When you throw in the humidity that we expect to see today, it's going to feel more like 105 degrees here in Lafayette. Definitely a hot day for us. Take a look over into St. Louis, though, 112 degrees. Again, we're seeing our heat kind of filter in from that direction, so you know our temperature is going to be warming up as we head into the seven-day as well. Already, though, we have to worry about a heat advisory. Now, it's only in effect for Warren and Fountain counties. It actually goes into effect a little bit later on this afternoon, around 1 o'clock, continues through 9. Now, it's only those two counties that are under the heat advisory, but certainly all of our counties will be seeing and experiencing really warm temperatures, so make sure you go ahead and take those precautions that come on along with it. Now, it does appear that a cold front's moving this way. I gotta say though, this is a really weak cold front and we're actually not expecting to see our temperatures decrease because of it. What this will do though is to kind of help spark some rain showers. In fact, if we zoom in a little bit closer, you're going to notice that the rain showers are really going to stay in our northern counties if we see any at all. Those rain chances are only at about a 20 to 30 percent chance of rain, so a really small chance there. As we go into your day Tuesday, I think the rain chance increases. You can see how some of them look like they're going to be storms that move through during the afternoon hours as well. And again, it's going to spark some of that rain, but more than anything, it's going to make it even more humid humid outside and with the heat that we're expecting tomorrow, that's certainly not a good thing. 93 degrees a high for tomorrow. Again, mix in that humidity. It's going to feel more like it's into the triple digits. And we already have a heat, excessive heat watch in effect for tomorrow for most of our southern counties, as you can see here. That is for tomorrow. Again, just another indicator. It's going to be another hot one. For today, dangerous heat, partly cloudy conditions, 92 degrees for your high. Again, feeling more like it's in the triple digits. For tonight, calm and muggy. Overnight fog expected to develop. Again, your low, 70 degrees. Then for Tuesday, another hot day. A chance of rain, though. Again, it's not really going to help us out, though, because it's just going to make it more muggy. 93 for your high. Taking a look at the rest of your seven-day forecast, you'll actually notice we're expecting to see more rain showers on Wednesday. Wednesday is actually our best chance of rain throughout the whole seven-day forecast. You'll notice that rain's on there a lot. Your rain chance, though, except for Wednesday, only at about a 30 to 40 percent chance of rain. Not a huge chance there. One thing we will see all week that's guaranteed, temperatures in the 90s.